All right, we're with Carrie Hallen in the Thornton Center, and Carrie is retiring after, you're going to have to tell me how many years again. How many years do you do this? Well, 26. 26 years as academic advisor for various Lady Ball sports. Carrie, can you put 26 years in perspective? And 26 is counting the year that, uh, the year and a half that I was a graduate assistant and trying to finish my master's so Joan could create the position. So that counts in there, too. So if you talk about all the, uh, in the 80s when we first started all this, all the, um, the new Proposition 48 and all the new standards for academics and athletics to where we are now where we're really into the progress toward degree and the gradu graduation success rates and everything, I've been through a lot. But mostly what comes to mind is how blessed I've been to be a part of uh, not only eight championships and with Pat and that, but mostly the 100% graduation rate that's ongoing and just pretty incredible. Okay, is that going to be your greatest memory, the graduation rate, or is it going to be more the, the, the individuals involved? Both. Uh, uh, graduation day is always, as Joan Cronin likes to say, my, my final four. I love those days, and I love seeing um, the success and the pride on their faces. But I think the relationships with each of the Lady Vols that I've been able to build and, and be able to um, just watch them grow and become successful women, that's going to be, that's very close to my heart. What's retirement going to be for you? What are you going to do in retirement? I'm going to be more busy than I am now. I'm going to find a way to make a little income while still uh, really just really getting into good physical and emotional shape. Golfing, gardening. Golfing, gardening. Uh, reading. Yoga, swimming, um, reading. Yeah. Walking the pups. You name it. I assume you're still coming to Lady Ball Games, too. I have to. I've been sworn to. <laughs> so any, any uh, what, 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 your legacy here, what, how do you want to be remembered? You know, people always say, what would you want on your own tombstone? I'm not suggesting, you know, obviously the, something's on your tombstone. But people always say, what would you want on your tombstone? What do you want to be known as? The, the one that, that gave her heart and soul to the academic, uh, uh, to the student part of the Lady Ball student athlete. And that uh, my legacy would be all that, the pioneering of that piece of what the Lady Ball program is and what a great, great program that is, thanks to Joan and Pat and all the players involved. She made a difference, so we'll boil that down to your tombstone? I hope so. I, I'm humbled by having been given that opportunity. Okay, thank you, Carrie. Thanks.